Hi, my name is Dr. Sasha McBain. I am a clinical psychologist and assistant professor at the University of Arkansas for Medical Sciences. I am a clinician and a researcher, and so my research is all about implementation of mental health screening and intervention in non-mental health settings. And my clinical work is working with our trauma surgery service here at UAMS and doing a lot of um, adjustment to illness and injury work and early intervention for PTSD. And I'm really excited to be talking with you today um, in collaboration with the ISTSS Production Committee for our new initiative called ISTSS Fast Facts. And so you can learn more about this initiative by going to our website, checking out our Twitter and social media. We have some information about what's happening, but basically we are collaborating with ISTSS members to leverage the expertise that we have within our organization to create new educational materials to disseminate. And so this is the first of our series of ISTSS Fast Facts, and we're gonna be talking about medical trauma. And this is something that's really relevant to my work and PTSD related to medical events. And so that can be um, traumatic stress reactions to life-threatening illness or injury or life-altering diagnoses. And we know that most people who experience a trauma recover and do well, but for those who do experience persistent traumatic stress um, after a medical trauma, it can have a significant impact not only on the person, but thinking about a larger public health impact and the impact that it has on our healthcare organizations. And we know that about 25 to 30% of children experience persistent traumatic stress after an injury. And among adults, it really depends on the type of event, but among those who are traumatically injured, about one in three experience PTSD or depression in the year following an injury. And so we're going to be disseminating materials over the next month that are relevant to PTSD following a medical trauma. And so we'll be uh, disseminating a clinician fact sheet, followed by maybe a patient fact sheet. And then on the last Friday of the month, we're gonna be disseminating a podcast where I'll have a chance to talk with the ISTSS Production Committee Chair, Dr. Melissa Zlinski, and her co-host and fellow committee member, Dr. Ann Wagner, about medical trauma and some clinical considerations and some ideas about where the field needs to go in terms of researching this area. And so we hope that you'll tune in over the next Fridays as we, we send out these new materials and I hope you find them useful and you take advantage of them and look forward to more in this series as part of the ISTSS Fast Facts.